what the groundhog says that tomorrow, but today it's all about the sunshine and the beautiful weather that we've got here in our studio that we're starting off with our little ray of sunshine who has joined us today. This is Sue Ma, registered dietitian, and you've literally brought sunshine in here this morning. Sue, thank you very much for doing this. My pleasure. Thanks for inviting me. Well, you know, it, it's beautiful. We're going to get everybody's day kind of kicked off on the right, right foot today because we are talking about eggs, which are, are kind of their own little ray of sunshine for us. Absolutely. You know, there was a survey done, and 59% of Canadians say that they're looking for healthier options during the winter to eat better. And the same survey found that 71% of Canadians are looking for a healthy and natural food to start their day off right. So why not start with eggs? Because we know they're super nutritious. And there's a special event going on tomorrow down in Toronto. You were telling me about this. I like it. And it looks like the weather's going to be perfect for It's it. going to be perfect. So the Egg Farmers of Canada is going to help Canadians wake up to yellow. So if you come on down to the Young and Dundas Square, which is right downtown Toronto, between 7.30 and 11.30, you'll see the square filled with 2,500 daffodils. So already that's a ray of sunshine. Plus you can pick up a free egg sandwich. So That's a nice way to start your it day. It sure is. Start your day with some sunshine, pick up a pot of flowers, and get the natural goodness of eggs to get your day going right. Yeah, you were talking about Canadians looking for a healthy way to start their day. I'm always looking for a breakfast food that's got protein yeah, in it. Oh we hear God. about how important yeah. protein is to, to get that kick that you need. You know what? Protein is so important. And Canadians know that, too, because 88% of Canadians are looking for a natural way to start their day. And when it comes to protein eggs, one egg has six grams of high-quality protein. Yes. And there's 14 essential nutrients like vitamin A, vitamin B12, iron, zinc, selenium, and vitamin D, which is a big one when it comes to wintertime here in and Canada. And huge for Canadians because we tend to, as a population, be, to be di uh, vitamin D deficient. Yeah, especially in the winter. So, okay. so, And not very many foods naturally contain vitamin D, and eggs are one of them. So we're lucky to have okay. that. I brought in some fabulous recipes to help viewers wake up to yellow in their own home. And I've got to start with this one. This is one of my favorite. Cutest <laughs> recipe ever. <laughs> and simple at the same time. And it's time. so simple. I made this for my daughter when she's three. When she was three. She's 13 now and we still love to make tilt this. that up so that we can see yeah. it from the camera because it's a sunshine. It, Look at that. And basically, the you make a sunny side up egg and then you take two pieces of bread. So the first bread, you cut a big circle then a smaller circle inside. And the second piece of bread, you just cut into little strips so that they become the rays of the sun. And it's, I mean, you could toast it, you can make French toast with the bread, but all in all, it's a nutritious breakfast. Pair it with a glass of milk and it's ready to go. It's so cute. My it's teenagers cute. would love that. <laughs> I still love eating that. <laughs> And so the second recipe is great if you're like busy in the morning, grab and go breakfast. These are egg muffins, and you can find this recipe at eggs.ca. Okay. Basically, just eggs and any vegetable you have in your fridge. So we've used some spinach, some red pepper, whip it up, pour it in your muffin tins, 20 minutes at 350, ready. You make How a nice is that? You can freeze them. Grab them in the morning with some fruit and go. Speaking of the website, I thought I knew everything there was to know about eggs. Yeah. Because growing up on a farm where right. we, we were egg producers, right. we had them there. My job was to clean the eggs and get them ready. Right. I thought we knew it all. But there's actually a quiz that you have on eggs.ca where you can go through and, and get to know your facts about eggs, things exactly. we might not know. Well, you know, did you know that eggs have no hormones and no steroids? And that's, I think, a misconception that people think, oh my goodness. So no steroids, no hormones. Doesn't matter if you want brown or white eggs. They're equally as nutritious. Same protein. And that's the big question everybody has. Are brown, is brown egg more nutritious than a white egg? It just egg, comes it? from a different hen. So if you like the brown, if you like the white, whichever you prefer, know that you're getting solid nutrition, great protein, 14 essential nutrients. This last recipe is another great one. Now, Canadians love eating omelets. And what we've done here is we've made an omelet burrito. So you make Ooh, your omelet with any good. vegetable. Yeah. And I've used green peppers. You could use cheese, mushrooms, anything you want. Put the omelet on a, a round tortilla, roll it up, cut it in half, pair it with some salsa if you'd like, grab there some oranges, go. a cafe latte, and there's oh, your nice breakfast. That. <laughs> that is perfect. Speaking of omelets, by the way, I was yeah. watching the video okay. on Exoxy on how to make an omelet. I've been making my omelets wrong all these years. <laughs> what have I've you been, been doing, doing wrong? wrong? Because you're supposed to push it into the pan as the egg is cooking to get what they call the, the curds. Yeah. 
on it instead of just letting it sit. I always just let it sit there, but you push it in and it yeah, cooks better that way. It does way. cook better. See, you learn a lot on my I'm learning a lot. Don't you? So now, Canadians, if you want to take a picture of your favorite breakfast using eggs, post it on social media, Twitter, Facebook, Pinterest, Instagram, with the hashtag wake up to yellow, because we want to see how you are waking up to yellow and bringing sunshine into your life. So whatever the recipe is, you just make it up. Yeah. Take the picture of it. Use the hashtag. Wake up to wake yellow. Up to yellow. Yeah. And then post it to social media. Yeah, we want to see it. I like that. So it, it would almost be, and the best part is, it's almost like this collection of great recipe ideas that you can get using I'm eggs. salivating already, looking forward to all the different recipes. You know, the other thing that I love about eggs, especially when we've been hearing so much in the news about prices going up, yes. prices of, of fruits oh, and yes. vegetables, everything is going up. Eggs become so affordable. When you consider what it costs for a dozen eggs, I know it's a great option. Now, when it comes to eggs, one or two eggs is considered one serving. So if you take that and divide it by the cost of a carton, it really is an economical source of protein when we're all trying to save money these days. Another thing I wanted to point out is where's the best place to store your eggs? Because we want to prolong our food as, as long as possible. So a lot of people take their eggs out and they put it in a nice little basket on the door. That's actually a no-no, guys. You want to keep it in the carton and in the fridge. I'd be doing that one right then. Yay. Okay. Yay. Just in the carton and the fridge is fine. Well, you know what? Eggs have about 10,000 pores around them. So if you take them out of the carton, they're going to absorb the smells of all the different foods in your fridge. The celery, the carrots, the garlic, whatever really? else you've got in there. So keep them in the carton as a bit of protection and in the fridge, not in the door. Learned another thing. And don't forget, if you happen to be one of the commuters from this area that's heading into Toronto, yep, tomorrow, downtown, Toronto. downtown Toronto, everybody can stop by or see all the yellow. You'll know that you're in the right place. Right. And you get a free breakfast you sandwich. Get a free egg. Wake up to the natural goodness of eggs. Why not? Wake up to yellow, everyone. Perfect. <laughs> and do use the hashtag, wake up to yellow. Get your recipes on. Use the social media. And share the goodness of eggs with everybody. Get cracking. Get cracking. Thanks for joining us, Thanks, Sue. Thanks, Susan. Oh, it feels so much better in here now. All this. We're back with more daytime in a moment. Stay with us.